Hello everyone. Welcome to the Computer Network Practical Series. Uh, in this session, we'll be doing the FTP, that is the File Transfer Protocol. So this protocol is used to transfer various files through uh, different media's different platforms. So this is the following. This is the topology we'll be using. We'll have a server, three PCs, a switch, and a router, and their IP addresses are also mentioned. So this is the configuration we'll be using. So router interface g00 will be used the ip would be 10.0.0.1 then server is 10.0.0.2 pc.3.4.5 and so on and then the default gateway of uh, this host would be 10.0.0.1 and subnet mask will be for each and every uh, interfaces 255.0.0.0 so let us do this on cisco packet tracer now we use cisco packet tracer to do the configuration so first we select the router 1941 okay and uh, then we select the pcs three pcs then the switch and then the server okay and do the connections for connection we use this particular wire copper straight through so fast ethernet of this with any of this connect all the p all the pcs as well as the other components with the so we use in this case we use the gigabit ethernet 00 and here the fast ethernet with any of this interface now we configure the ip we just put the ip addresses on the interfaces first we start with the router so here in config we click on gigabit 00 and first turn it on then the ip address is, as we know that is 10.0.0.1 this will come automatically then we will start with the pc first so pc 0 put the ip address as 10.0.0.3 okay. 2 is of server and this 10.0.0.1 no no need to set the dns server in this case then the second pc is uh, 10.0.0.4 and this is the default gateway 10.0.0.1 mm -hmm. then the last pc it is 10.0.0.5 and then this is 10.0.0.1 now we need to configure the server so first we'll uh, configure the ip address so here we we'll configure the ip is 10.0.0.2 okay and then this is <coughs> 10.0.0.1 .0 the default gateway now we need to enable the service okay so we click on the service tab and here you can see the FTP we click on FTP now by default this service is always on okay and here we can see there is a username and password Cisco is already there so we want to make a new username and password so I'll just put here uh, smile as the username uh, in small letters so S M I L E smile and uh, I'll put the password also as smile okay s m i l e okay sorry uh, this it should be m i l e okay and then uh, we can just give all the permissions here read write delete rename and list permissions to this username i'll just add this so when we add we get this okay i'll just close this now and click on any of the pcs let us click on this particular pc and uh, go in command prompt okay click on command prompt we'll get this so here i'll type the command ftp space then the ip address of the server so it is 10.0.0.2 now you can see trying to connect connected to 10.0.0.2 and it is giving the uh, message welcome to ftp server now it is asking for the username so either i can use cisco or smile i'll use smile sm i l e and enter 
so username is okay it need the password of course the password is also smile s m i l e when you type this password you won't see anything there okay so but it is taking the password okay so i'll just enter it you can see we this is we got the entry into the ftp okay so this is how we can uh, use this ftp we we enter the into the ftp service and we can use this service so that's all for this particular session thanks for watching